And Pikachu is starting off using her little slave toe for defense. As always. I have no idea what I'm doing. Ass attack. Quick attack spam into a Pika break dance. Oh, you got big slap. The one thing I don't like about Peach is the inherent randomness of her character. Yeah. Like her forward smash has three different varieties. Each guy has different knockbacks and have different lengths. And then there's also the turn out. Sometimes you get a really good turn out. Sometimes you get uh, like sometimes you get epic turn out, which is instant 35% damage. And sometimes you get pathetic turn up. And the items are on. See, see the difference is frying pan knocks the opponent straight up. Golf club knocks them more horizontal. Actually, no, golf, golf club and head. Well, no, it does roughly the same amount as the other two, but it goes like almost completely vertical. The golf club has the longest reach of all three of them and sends them a, a middle between. The tennis racket has almost completely horizontal. And it sends the into break dance into thunder. Oh, tail whip, beach butt. Oh, uh, peach break dance. Oh, nice attack. Nice, nice. <laughs> it's gonna be a very, I mean, wow, wow. Pika only. Pikachu's deaths so far are attributed to two SDs, one of which assisted by Casey with the edge guard. One of the, one of the hardest things to do with Peach is her, like her biggest advance tech is floating right next to the ground, like right at the ground. And then using like the crown, the uh, the half dance of doom. And he he just plants the turnip back in the ground. But Buster. Oh, Thunder Shot. Thunder Shot. Oh, four. We have yet to see a crown of doom hit. Physically most powerful move. Finally, a quick attack that works. Nice. Got wanged with the frying pan. He should have taken that frying pan antidote. <laughs> FTW. Yeah. <laughs>